Hey guys, so okay, welcome back to Daggeropa V3, the talent development plan. Let's continue developing our lovely students. We've developed Chiaki, Mew, and Rantaro nice in shot. this round of development before we hit the Despair Dungeon after the next character. We still need to decide who we're going to be developing. I am going in no particular order. I seem to be jumping between games as well. But I think we should reserve the Danganronpa 2 and 1 characters for later, once I've unlocked more of them. As we've seen with Chucky, we didn't actually have a complete party. Uh, I accidentally clicked on listen to her explanation, so that's why we're going through all that again. Um, so let's stick to V3 here. We've got two girls. We've got Rantaro done, so maybe another guy. I don't know, we can do Shuichi, we can do Kaito, Ryoma, Kokichi. We are never going to be doing Kyo. <laughs> I'm sorry, what was that? Come on, apologize. 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 Okay, we'll do you. Fine. Goodness me. This guy's a handful, isn't he? Alright. Let's do Kyo. Let's start with a normal course. <sighs> Oh my gosh, this is going to be an adventure, observe. isn't it? Hope's Peak Academy, where ultimate students gather. There must be many wonderful people. Here he goes on a recruitment drive for friends for his sister. <laughs> I am excited. Very excited indeed. What sort of human beauty will I witness here? Oh boy, girls, watch out. Keo is in town and he ain't taking any prisoners, only murder victims. Let's get rolling. Five, one, two, three, and we get a friendly square straight off the bat. Nice, I like it. I like to get the friendly squares out of the way early so we can uh, start developing our character for the Despair Dungeon. <laughs> I don't think this one's gonna be a very good friend for your sister there, Keo. Totally not adorable. What is it? How rude to declare such a thing upon seeing someone. But your words will not faze me. Mm, totally not adorable. <laughs> I can probably see a demand for you, but you just don't cut it for me. He's not an adorable little boy, is he? You're not gonna string him up with scissors? Mm. That's unfortunate. <laughs> I have no issue with that. I doubt anything good will come from being your type. You also do nothing for me. Only cleanly people are suitable to be sister's friends. Whew, Togo. Slash genocide Jack. My gloomy side is the one who doesn't bathe. It's her fault I get this filthy. By the by, what happens to the suitable girls? You find any worthy ones already? Well... I could ask the same of you. What happens to those who cut it for you? I can imagine him doing the quotes in his little bandaged hands there. I must interject. What? 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 Ooh, Miss Ogre just showed up, dragging her knuckles like the ape woman she is. Hey. I felt a great disturbance in the air. What were you two discussing? <laughs> Nothing! We were just chit-chatting and sipping some tea. Hmm. I see. Then that's fine. I must be imagining things. My apologies. <laughs> I do not mind. I am accustomed to people thinking I am suspicious. That's because you are, dude. You are very suspicious. <laughs> Listen. In regards to your question from earlier, though. Yep. Hmm? My question? <laughs> I will say... The decision shall be put on hold for the time being. I do not wish to be seen as any more suspicious than I already am at this school. Because you are a serial killer, right? You've already been adding friends to your sister's, you know, gallery up there. God knows where. So you and Genocide Jack are actually more alike, huh? Yeah, I don't think Sakura's gonna be your friend, your sister's type though, so lucky for Sakura. But uh, Hina might be, so eek. Sakura's not going to be having any of that. Hmm, yes, yes. Ah, we'd be in big trouble if she got mad. We'll call it off for now. Phew. Everyone just frowning at the end there. Anyway, we've got strength out of that. I don't know how, but we'll take it. Oh, Sonya. Phew. Man, we're just going to be dodging people. All right, let's try and avoid failing the first course. Even though I'd love to fail Kyo, but, you know. Like, Kyo's the guy... Man, I really, really hated him, and I, I guess now he's grown into the guy I kind of love to hate now. <laughs> but boy, oh boy, at the time I was so mad, just simply because he's the one who's responsible for Tenko's death. Like, seriously, I was having none of it at the time. You ran into Monokuma. Well, look at them, best buds on a friendly square, no less. Receive double square card. Friendly square. Say. Hero, there is a question I would ask you. Yo! Hmm? What's up, Cory? <laughs> Is that what we're calling him now? Yeah. I have wondered for some time. 
What format do you use for your fortune telling? I know, right? Do you use the caged dog, ch caged dog child, caged child song? I've already forgotten the name of this, the stupid seance spell that he uses. Although, fortune telling is a single umbrella term, there are many ways to go about it. One might divine the future with palms, birthdays, or tools such as cards, yes? Hmm. Wow, Cory, you know your stuff. But my fortune telling is different from all of those. It's an inspirational style. It works 30% of the time, every time. <laughs> Very I inspirational. See. Inspiration? Also known as revelation, flashes, or one's sixth sense. It's not like some occult mystery. But don't lump my fortune telling in with the occult, you got it? Because my predictions are on the mark more than pretty much anyone else's. Actually. But why are you asking about all that? You want your fortune read? I'll give you a discount. No. I was merely curious what style of fortune telling has been acknowledged as ultimate. You see. Many styles of fortune telling have long historical roots, stretching back generations. They are all of great interest to me as an anthropologist. Could it be? So in other words, you want to know more about my fortune telling, huh, Cory? Well. I would not mind if you interpreted it that way. Well? Then I suggest you start by actually having your fortune told by me. It's a thousand bucks, isn't it? For something that's less than 50% accurate? No way. Get out of town. Seeing it done for yourself is the best way to learn about it, right? I see, yes. Indeed. I know your fortunes are expensive. But it may be to my benefit to experience one. I suppose he is the ultimate clairvoyant, right? So he has, a, he has some right to charge that exorbitant fee. Woo! Yeah, you get it, Cory. Because of that, I'll give you, I'll tell you a bonus story, no charge. Mm. I have a bad feeling about this, but I shall listen. I mean, we saw that hero can be right, right? With the bad ending on Dengar Porn. Well? I've got these power stones here. They almost have as much energy as the crystal ball I use. Hmm. Ah. <laughs> it's not like some occult mystery. Normally, they're crazy expensive, but if you buy them through me, they're just 500,000 yen. How much is that? Hang on, let me do a quick calculation here. Give me a moment. I just have to know. 500,000 yen, let's see... 875, that's 6.666k in New Zealand dollars, which is about... Uh... Actually... Oops. Do -do -do -do. So, I'm clearly bored. I'm sorry, never mind, it's the cannon's brain. <laughs> Forget mm. it. I see. Actually, I bet someone like you could draw out their true power. No problem, Cory. Hang on, wait, no, no, I'm determined to calculate this in USD. <laughs> At, uh, about 4.5k USD. Hmm. Is that, am I right? I'm sure. That's the exchange rate right now. Listen. By the way, hero. When you say Cory, you are referring to me, correct? Yo! Well, duh. Correct, yo, is kind of a mouthful, you know? I guess my name's the same, though, huh? Yes. Well, I normally tell those who have trouble with my name to call me Keel. I do not mind Cory either. Please refer to me as that whenever you wish. You know? Oh, sure thing, leave it to me. Well, then. Very good. In that case, I shall see you later, hero. Yo! See ya, Cory. Huh? Huh? Wait, Cory, what about the Power Stones? The bargain did not pay off. Nope. We, we're gonna get ripped off right there. <laughs> Today is the sports festival. Your card for the scavenger hunts is the person you like. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, jeez. The one you like most is always inside you. So going to the goal alone would be correct. Of course. But explaining that seems problematic. How will you deal with this? Well, we're definitely not taking our mask off. That might scare everyone. Perhaps I'll exchange my card. I'll take a broad interpretation of like. I shall observe the others instead. Well, you know what he's up. You know what he came to Hope Speak Academy for, so we shall observe the others. Well, <laughs> well I needn't win. It would serve me much better to observe everyone else. Well, you can see how to turn away girls. Turn away friends for your sister. Therefore. So... Teru Teru, I give this card to you. Huh? Huh? Is that even allowed? 
Tell me your thoughts. This card is more sur- suited to you than me. Look at it, and you will understand. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Hmm. The person you like, huh? I see. You got shy, huh? You do look like you'd be the shy type, Kyo. <laughs> I, on the other hand, think it's fine to talk openly about love. This card does suit me. But if you're giving me this card, does that mean you want to reach the goal together? Mm. I did not foresee this outcome. You politely declined. <laughs> yeah. Nope. Sorry. I even even Keo has his limits here. Alright. Let's actually finish the course. Two, three. Even though we're rolling sixes all of a sudden. This way. Actually, I think the other way would be fine, but it doesn't matter. Mint Square, what have we got? You're taking a walk. Oh, jeez. You get run over by a rampaging monokid. We chase after him. But he felt bad about it and shared some honey with you as an apology. Focus increased. Thanks. I didn't even need to chase after him and get my revenge. Alright, well, don't confuse your hero for our chick. Please. Yeah, let's just go this way. Why not? You ran into Chihiro Fujisaki, received an encounter card. Alright. We're missing out on a lot of these uh, double squares, but that's okay. One, two, let's go this way then. Toko. You ran into Toko Fukawa, received zero move card. I forgot what Kyo bloody is. I'd say he's an intelligent it's, uh, character. Could be wrong. Nah, we're good. He's either that or variety, he's definitely not strength. Now we're rolling the crappy as numbers. Four times two. Thankfully we landed on the times two square. Oh, it's Izuru Kamakura himself. Another four? Goodness me. I should have just used the double square cards while we're in this path, but alas. Actually, I can use it right now. Double square card. And zero move card. Excellent. Gamed it. Well done, Keo. You anthropologist, you. Yeah, we'll definitely make the gold for sure. Mikan, luckiest day of your life there. You'd make a wonderful friend. Oh, geez, look at these two troublemakers standing in the way. Ah, damn it. Despair square. No worries. It's not like we had that much attributes. Nagito could have given us the hope card, but nope. Had to run right past that guy. Ah, Kokichi! My fellow V3 student. Double square card. Nice. Alright, first exam. Nice. We made it. Who's going to be in our party, I wonder? Is there a new skill? I don't think I've got enough fragments, right? Well, barely. Nope. Nothing. None whatsoever. That's fine. Let's just skip it for the first year. Don't first exam, surely we can beat it. Alright. Kyo, Tenko, Tsumugi, and Angie. Wow. <laughs> what a party. The two people he killed and the mastermind of the entire game. Spoiler alert. But, you know, you should really have watched V3 before you came here. Anyways. Uh, attack. Submarine Fist. Electric Paralyze All. And Angie with the variety. Just attack. Nine damage, that's not so bad for a regular attack. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Give me the attributes, give me the levels. Oh, nice. Alright, at least Monodom's not complaining about the lack of uh, assistance from the Cubs. Look at that. Definitely worth trying to beat these exams. Continue on the normal course, and then we'll finish off on the friendly course if we uh, haven't gotten all the friendly squares by then. Alright, before we start, is there anything I can use to take advantage of? Not right now. Encounter card will just get me to Izuru, which is not very far. And double square card, we might as well save that for the double squares already, so we can quadruple our skills. Oh, another friendly square. Kia's doing quite well. Ifumi Yamada, six move square. Oh, six move card, I should say. Hey. Oh, Kia, it's been a while. You took the day off yesterday, right? I think I've done this a bit yes. before, but that's okay. That is correct. I returned from my field work only just last night. I see you have returned as well, Rantaro. Where did you go this time? Yeah. Southeast Asia. 
I just got back the day before yesterday. But I've got another trip planned tomorrow. We almost missed each other. Let's see. You are ever busy, flitting around the world as you do. It may sound strange coming from me, but you seem pale. It may be best to recuperate. Hmm. Actually. Uh, maybe. But there's still so many places I want to go. Isn't it the same for you? I... The answer to that question is... Precisely. For research, of course, but of another reason as well. Mm -hmm. Another reason? <laughs> Oddly enough, when I look at you, I sense that we are kindred spirits. Tell me your thoughts. You too are flitting around with a purpose. That is what I have deduced. <laughs> <laughs> well, you are good at observing people. Hey. Do you have any siblings, Keo? Oh, geez, not yes. this question again. I do. An older sister. Is that right? Oh, nice. Are you too close? Let's see. Very much so. She's inside me. Figuratively. Figuratively, guys. My sister is someone who is very important to me. Very important indeed. Wow, impressive. You said that without much prompting, Keo. That was kind of unexpected. That's true. But in that case, maybe you understand. Hmm. To have asked me such a question? Do your travels have something to do with siblings? Yeah. Something like that. I see. That explains it. I shall not stop you from pushing yourself in that case. I too wish to do everything I can for my sister. That is how I feel. Is that right? <laughs> and here I thought no one would ever really understand. Tell me your thoughts. I understand deeply. <laughs> By the way, the sibling you are pushing yourself so hard for, is it a brother? A sister? Yeah. Oh, um, little sister. Hmm. The fact that you have so much drive must mean you have a wonderful sister. That's right. Oh, yeah, much better than me. <laughs> Is that so? I won't ask in detail, but I shall root for you. When the day comes that you have fulfilled your goal, I would like to hear more of your sister. <laughs> Jeez. His sister is out of bounds, Keo. Okay, keep away. Thank you. Rising. What do we got? Yeah. Oh, no, I'm not taking a chance on the surgery. Why? Yeah, your support can go if itself, seriously. Last time we dropped so many levels with poor old Gonta, we found out how he became like Gonta, you know? Anyway. Chihiro. Just missed you, my friend. Alright. Keep going. Hina! Oh, ran right past her. Lucky stay of your life. <laughs> to be honest, you seem like someone his sister would gladly spend time with. Uh, what do we got here? Sorry, just checking my cards. I'm gonna try and land on the friendly squares. Three, four, five. Nice, there we go. Surely this is the last one, right? And then we can move on to just focusing on talents. Huh? Oh, yeah, and we've had this one as well. That's good. Awesome. How long have you been standing there, Kyo? Yes. I've been here for some time. I didn't wish to interrupt your prayer. <laughs> Thanks for being considerate. Do you want to join me, Kyo? Atua has spoken. If you convert now, you'll get a great deal on some exclusive services. Let's see. I think I shall decline for now. Uh... For now? This offer will not last forever, you know. Do you understand? How can I believe in your god when I barely know anything about him? His origins, his doctrines, the ways in which he is worshipped. I can infer some from your words, but I have yet to hear a proper explanation. I see, I see! You have a genuine interest in Atua beyond mere worship. The truth is... Because you are curious about Atua, right? That is what he is telling me. Well... Yes, I am curious as an anthropologist. Is it a problem if that's why I'm interested? Uh... I would like to say that all are welcome, but... You can't do that! Atua's business hours are closed for today. Too bad. Hmm. I see. That is unfortunate. Come back tomorrow, he's napping. You know the guy. He's very moody. Pray and he gets tired time. easily. You know, if you want to hear the voice of Atua, you must pray. Hey, if you were praying outside business hours, Angie, you're not going to get any rewards or points for that. Come on. Jeez, you think you'd be more efficient about that. Atua brings salvation, but only to those who believe. No, no. Those who do not will face his judgment, you know. <laughs> How scary. 
I shall have to rein in my academic interests to avoid your guard's wrath. Yeah, well, I'm sure we'll find other ways to smite you, okay? Um... Large move. Let's go this way. Stop. You're taking a walk. Again. Suddenly a bookcase falls. Seriously, this floating library needs to be, like, shifted out of campus. But you dodge it gracefully. Phew, that was close. Agility increased. What's this year's event? Nope, it's Cubs again. Course change car. Awesome. Handy, just in case things go spectacularly wrong. Um, yeah, well, we haven't, we can only go this way now, so there you go. October? Double square? Hang on. If I do a six move. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, worth it. Card, double square, and a six move. Six mover. Right, now we're being more efficient about our thing. All good. Oh, not this bloody music again. Today is the school festival. You're running the haunted house. A guest approaches. So we're teamed up with other people, right? Uh. Ooh, princess. Oh my. Okay, here we go. This will be good. All right. Why naturally? I plan to complete two laps of the whole academy. I mean, she's into the occult and all this stuff, right? So she'd surely enjoy the haunted house. Oh, you seem quite enthusiastic. As a princess, our student festival's rare for you. I can imagine your sister being friends with a princess. Yes. Jeez, that's one for the trophy cabinet, isn't it? I feel quite invigorated to attend as a student. In my country, I visited academies as royalty. It was my duty to cut the largest scong each year to begin the festival. Hmm. What an intriguing tradition. I would love to visit your kingdom as an anthropologist. You watched with interest as Sonia entered the haunted house. <laughs> oh my. Hopefully she came out of the haunted house okay. You didn't set a trap or anything in there, did you? Because <laughs> you're running the show. Anyway, we're good. Princess is safe and sound. Kazuichi wouldn't hear the... We wouldn't hear the end of it from Kazuichi if uh, she got kidnapped or anything like that. Or Gundam Tanaka, the supreme overlord of ice. Toko Fukawa, zero move. Well, Kyo's on track to be one of the most powerful in our group, besides Chiaki. So if we run into a despair square, again, the same exact one. Monokuma, at least he gives us a double square card. Keep it going, Kyo. Alright, it's good that we landed on this square, actually. We need we need the talent fragments. Last month. Okay, I don't know if we're going to pass this exam. I seem to be having trouble passing the second one. I think I passed it with Tenko, didn't I? Last time? Yeah, one more. Pico, we get a card, and talent fragments. Straight card. That's going to be handy. All right, let's hit it. Let's wreck these Monokuma fools. Uh, what are we going? Ice freeze? I prefer like an all attack. I feel. It's always more useful. All right. Let's get along. Thank you, Monodon, for explaining that it is harder than last year. Uh, should we just do the auto all out? Angie's already down. Oh, really? What kind of all out is that? Should have just taken matters into my own hands. All out, we did one damage. To like each of these guys. Terrible. Alright, well. All out. All out down to the bloody infirmary. More like it. Why? Jeez. <laughs> guys. That was terrible effort. Should have just done the bloody all attack. Uh, 
I could do the future course, but like, especially now that I've got like the street card, I could go all the way, but it's just events and talent fragments, right? And, uh, hmm, I don't know. I don't think we need to do the friendship course. We've pretty much done all the events, I think. Talent course, this gives us a lot of fragments, but without the attributes, you know, it's not like it's going to be very helpful, right? Or is it? I don't know. I think the normal course is fine. Just focus on leveling. Let's get through the day. I think we can take that long path now that we've got the straight card. We'll just use it as soon as we get onto it. And another friendly square. Perfect. Just in case we missed any events. Junko Inoshima, double move card. Let's get rid of the zero. Or let's get rid of the course change card. We don't really need it at this point in time. Oh, there we go. We still got another event. Ow! Was that an empty can? Yes. Ah, here you are, Makoto. <laughs> oh, Kyo. Did you happen to see that? How embarrassing. Unacceptable. It appears the can was thrown from a window. You have my condolences. <laughs> can him randomly hit by a can? Man, that's pretty unlucky. Oh? Unlucky? That's an odd thing for an ultimate lucky student to say. Hmm. Yeah. I was lucky to have been picked out of all high schoolers in my country. But for me, stuff like this is normal. Honestly, I'm more used to being unlucky. I guess they're researching luck here at Hope's Peak Academy, but I wonder if I'm helping. I mean, it's funny because the ultimate lucky student gets chosen every year, right? So we've got Makoto, we've got Nayuto, but we've got nothing from the V3 year, obviously, because it's different. It's a different academy all around. Um, the ultimate academy for gifted juveniles and whatnot. However. So are these guys, the V3 characters, just transfer students or something? I don't know. Perhaps luck is something not easily measured. Good and bad luck are woven together like rope. Do you understand? I shall go ahead and say, Makoto, you are lucky after all. Have you checked out what's in the can? Are you sure it's empty? What? Huh? Listen. We ended up chatting, but the reason I came to talk to you was to deliver this. What? Oh, that's my wallet. I wonder when I dropped it. Thanks, Kyo. So then... The can hit you and made you cry out. Hearing that, I looked over. And thus, I was able to deliver your wallet. That could be considered good luck, yes. Well, uh, that's more of Nagito's luck, right? Something bad happens before something good happens, right? Hmm. Um, when you put it like that, maybe it was good luck after all. What is it? Perhaps whether something is good or bad luck needs to be decided after all is said and done. Yeah. Well, that can hurt pretty bad. And I dropped my wallet... Thanks. But you're right. I'll try being more positive. I was lucky you picked it up, Kyo. Thanks. Alright, so I guess there's five events for each character, right? So that's the fifth one. I don't think there's going to be any more, but you never know, so we'll see. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Rolling this way, rolling. Event square. Came into the dining hall. Let's try today's special soup. It doesn't taste like that crappy-ass pasta the Cubs made, right? You begin to feel your body fill up with raw power. What was in that soup? Influence increased. Oh, I like it. Good. More health. It's always good. What do you got for me? A one move card? Meh. Uh, let's get rid of the zero move card. Keep it rolling. Celeste. Uh, this way. Okay, let me just check the course for a bit. I need to know my bearings. I feel like this is the trap. And that's the extra long way. But what am I going to get out of it if I'm just going to be skipping all those squares, right? Like... Hmm. Like, I might as well just go here. Where, um... where Hyoko is. I suppose it doesn't end in a times two, right? Let's just go the long way. Another friendly square. Jeez, just my luck. Alright, there we go. Confirmed. Five events per person. I think someone's already mentioned that. I'm sorry, I've forgotten. <laughs> I'll move right past Mew. And past poor old Hajime as well. Come across a pair of boxing gloves, decide to try them on. 
Oh, the power. You really want to try some cross counters, but we're going to punch the door, right? <laughs> but you don't want to slug anybody, so you just jab at the door a few times. Fence increased. Glad he doesn't want to sock a punch to, like, Kokichi or someone, right? Speak of the devil, he's right next to me. Okay. Awesome. And then let's just focus on getting to the goal after this. Uh, straight card. Double square. And then a straight card. Sorry, friends. Right past ya. 32. Alright, not many rolls to go. Let's keep going. Another friendly square. Jeez, he's really on the prowl, looking for friends. For his sister, or for himself, I don't know. <laughs> he's, he's looking for something. That's all I know. December... Anything uh, worth using? Should we just use the double move card right now? Get it out of the way. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yay or nay? Nah, let's just finish the course. Rather than doing all these unnecessary, like, <laughs> side adventures. Okay, and we get double double talent fragments as well. For our troubles. Your last winter at the academy. The Monocubs have suggested that you all clean the school. Wow, why? So where will you clean? I wonder, actually, are these all students in the same year then? They must be, right? Because they all do the three years rather than... Uh, so there's going to be two ultimate lucky students in this one uh, in this one class. Interesting. Uh, the dining hall. Clean your own room. Yeah, get rid of the evidence. You know, all those knives you probably used to make friends. Oh, huh? jeez. Oh, Karikio! Aren't you going to clean the school? Yes. But I thought I would clean my own room first. Your own room? Are you sure that's really a priority right now? Well... I know we are meant to prioritize communal spaces for something like this. Oh dear. But my notes and documents are starting to pile up. Cleaning is a difficult task. I'd prefer to take an opportunity like this to organize everything. I see! You take your research very seriously. He's an ultimate, right? Of course he does. Very well then, you've convinced me to give you permission. No. Your permission doesn't really matter. You're not the teacher here. Usami is. You're the twisted version. You can't! Oh, that's right. I'm not a teacher right now. What is it? You. A teacher. Hey! I know I may not look like it, but I really am supposed to be everyone's teacher. I still feel like I'm your teacher. I'll always be there for you, Korekio. Hmm. Really. No matter what happens. Hmm? Really, I mean it. Um, is something the matter? No, it's nothing. I am grateful for your thoughts. Trust. Expectations. The beauty of humanity can be seen even when such feelings are crushed. Well... Although, you are not a person. You cleaned your room with Monami. As in, like, she helped me, or I used her as, like, a cloth. <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully we didn't skin her or anything like that. <laughs> to use to absorb all the filth and dirt. Um... We can use the encounter card. Mahiru. Six move. Probably need red fragments as well, actually. But that's too late now. Two, three, four. Actually, no, it's not too late. I can use the six move card. I wouldn't get much, though. What are we going to get? Eleven. Huh? That's serviceable, right? Here we go! One last ride. Just shy of Monami. Lucky us. Rise and sh Leave it to me! Really? You're gonna give me a support? You're gonna give me support at the very end. Thanks, Cubs. Jeez. What am I supposed to do with that? Rise and sh Anyway. Learn a new skill. Nice freeze all. Alright, that's as far as we're gonna go. 
I probably should have done like recover influence as well, but I think I can do that at the end, right? This time we're actually gonna choose our own damn skills. Thanks, game. For nothing. <laughs> uh just focus on Keo, keep him healthy. Oh, wow, now that's more like it. 1920 and 25. Oh jeez. At least Tsumugi barely survived. Come on, make it a good one. Alright, they seem resistant to electric. I think we've got the speed to kill them, surely, but I don't know how much health they have, I can't remember. Um, based off the Despair Dungeon, right? Nice, that's it. Woohoo! Extra levels. Keo prepared well for his exam. 36. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah, now we're definitely screwed now. <laughs> See, if only I did this in the first place, in the second exam, we could have been a lot farther along. Angie just got nuked. Tanko got nuked. Poor girls. Both victims in this case as well. Yeah, now we're done for here. One damage, one damage, two damage. Basically tickled them. 278 damage. Jeez. Yeah, no, we're not getting anywhere without those U cards. But we're going to be do hitting the Despair Dungeon next after this episode anyways, so that's cool. Looking forward to what uh, Kyo can contribute. Alright, obtain skills. Let's finish up Ice Freeze as much as we can. And recover influence as much as we can. Alright, that'll do us. Well done, Kyo. Not bad at all. Not a bad effort. Rising out! Alright, thanks guys, again well, for a wonderful three years at Hope Speak so Academy. I researched much as an anthropologist, but my dream has gotten further from me. Why is that? Because you didn't kill anyone while you attended the school? And thus, Kurekyo Shinguji graduated from Hope's Peak Academy without adding any notches to his belt. Thank the Lord. Don't